everybody i'm back with another unboxing and today i'm pretty excited about bringing you another unboxing for um the real littles uh real brands real cute um this is the plain pringles pack that i haven't found yet until you know today this one comes with um a visible uh white grape jug with a white grape Shopkin, so I don't know what his name is yet until we open it up and take a look at the checklist. Um, let's see, it, this pack includes eight mini, eight mini packs and eight Shopkins, so that's pretty cool. Um, we can take a look at the back here. It looks, it says, "Look for the limited edition Bling brand." So I'm assuming that the ones they're gold. I don't know if they're real gold dipped. It doesn't say they are, so they're probably not, but they are gold col col colored. And then you have uh, the special edition Skechers, which it seems that uh, they're not too hard to find because there's only four of them. So, But um, yeah, let's go ahead and um, open this up. So guys, I'm looking at the checklist now, and let's see if I can get this focus. Blaze is here with us today. Um, the one that's showing is Quinn, Quinn Grape Juice. So Quinn is really, really cool in the aspect that he has a harder plastic on the outside of his soft rubber to make it look like he's a glass and full of spilling over grape juice. And you can see the white grape juice and you can see a teal straw coming out of it. And Quinn is a very happy guy. I'd be happy if I was some white grape juice, too. And here is our Welch's grape juice container. It is hollow plastic. If you want to put Quinn inside, it opens up the bottom. And it's legit labeling, guys. It's really cool. Um, it's basically just shrunk down to Shopkin size. I mean, some of the wording isn't really readable. But, um, yeah. The only difference on it is it says Shopkins. And it won't say that in the store. And here is our Pringle. Our plain, uh, the original Pringles to unbox. It says more Shopkins and mini packs inside. Surprises in, to find inside. It shows you how to open it. And then here's the back. Hang loose with the juice. Don't be jelly. Pop it and lock it. And we're going to go ahead and tear this tear strip open. If I can. That pause in here. And then it comes out on one string, kind of like Happy Places does, does. So here it is on our one string. So we're going to start at the top here. The first one we have. Ooh, this is a new one for us on this channel. Let's see. The first one we have is. Butterscotch pudding, uh, snack pack. So I don't know how this opens, guys. I think it might open right in the middle here. Oh, that's really cool. Who could be inside here? Okay, it's a blind. Oh, there's two in there. Hmm. So inside. So inside of our pudding, our our snack pack. We found these little guys, and they're not in a dish or anything. They're they're very squishy, and it's almost like they you dumped the cup out. Um, I have to see what their names are. Okay, so the, they're legit called the Butterscotch Buddies. And you can see that their faces are basically the opposite expressions. They're pretty cute. One's got a bigger smile than the other, you can see. And one's looking to the side, and one's looking forward. So they're pretty cute, I think. I'm going to put them back in their little package here. I don't know how they would go. Well, we're, we're going to leave them out so we can take a peek. That was a good start. Oh. They're bouncy. They're bouncy buddies. Okay. So our next one, we're moving down on the package here. 
Our next one is... What do I see in here? I think it's going to be some shoes. Hopefully it's some new shoes. It looks like we have Air Skechers. And let's see what, what Air Skechers looks like. Air Skechers is a purple shoe. I think this is a new one for us. I'm pretty sure. And inside here we have... Oh my gosh, guys. Let's see if I can get this to focus. How cute is this one? This is uh, Cela. Celia? I, I think Cela. Uh, Cela Strawberry Spread. So it's really, really squishy. Well, not super squishy, not sticky squishy, but squishy. And then, uh, so it's supposed to be on a spoon. And the spoon is harder. And it looks um, to be pearlescent. So it's a pearlescent purplish um, pink. And I don't know why there's leaves on the top. I guess it's just to remind you that it's a strawberry. But is she not super cute? <laughs> I'm just going to put her in the back here. So our next one that we're opening up is going to be a shotgun number four, but three vi invisible. It looks like, ooh, I didn't even know this was an option here. We have Fudge Stripe Keebler Fudge Stripe Originals. So look at this cute little package here. Um, on the back it even says, Fudge-tastic works of art. And you can read all about it on here if you guys want to. Pause that, check it out. Uh, it is a hard plastic, and I think it opens right here. And then we have our blind bag inside. So here we have fudgy stripes. Oh my goodness, guys. Look at it. It's a pile of fudge stripe cookies. I love these cookies. Fudgy stripes is amazing. I think I have a new favorite Shopkin. I say that all the time, I know. But uh, look how cute he is, guys. You see how cute that is? Oh my gosh. All right. And he's got this cute packaging, too. I can't get over it. And the next one we have op to open here looks like the Manwich. I don't know if there's two different Manwiches, but I know we have opened up the Manwich on this channel. Um, let's see. And here is Sloppy Joe. <laughs> I love this guy, guys. I love the detail on him. I love the little sesame seeds in his bun. I love the toast, buttery toastness of the top. I love how it has all the different peppers, red and green, inside of his sloppy Jonas. And the next one we're opening up here, guys, it seems like a soft one. I haven't gotten one of these ones yet. Oh, it's in a bag. Okay. Um, it is uh, Kellogg's Fruity Snacks Berry Mix. So this is going to be one of those ones that Ziploc open, just like that. And who do we have inside? Looks like somebody really... Oh, wow. Whoa. I don't... Whoa, guys! It's like a handful of gummies! Oh, wow. We got a strawberry and probably... I don't know. Let's see what they're called. Okay, they're called Berry Cute Snacks. Um, what I love the most about these is that they are like the size of fruit snacks and they are the texture of fruit snacks they're very gummy uh not gummy to a point where stuff will stick to them uh but uh very bouncy gummy almost like an ushi type squish so i'm gonna put that here and we are down to our last shopkins for this video and it looks like we have a beef ravioli This one's going to be really cute, I think. This is Renata Ravioli. How cute is she? Oh my goodness. And then she has the uh, beef, like a little bite taken out of the side of her. You can see the beef inside, the beefy goodness. Um, she's got a little bit of a tannish color. Um, if you guys can see that on the top of her. Um, to represent the cooking, maybe even a little bit of a sauce. And then she comes to a little bit of a bend there, which, which you know a lot of the Ravioli's do. But that's how she stands. So that's pretty cool. Oh, I'm so excited about this line, guys. I, It's like more and more and more and more and more. <laughs> I, I, I have to... Okay. Here we go, guys. So these are everybody that we got today. 
If I would have to choose one that was my favorite, I would have to... It's really tough because they're all really so cool. But um, I'm going to have to go with Fudgy Stripes over here. Because yummy and really cool. Um, but they all are. They all have their own coolness to them. And I love the packaging. I love how it's things that kind of hit home. You guys, you guys can either remember eating them as kids or, like me, still eating them. <laughs> if you like this video, go ahead, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And we will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.